In this video, I want to show you how to do a full factory restore reset on any Roku television. Now, this is an insignia, but it doesn't matter what brand of TV that you have. So what a full factory reset is, is it'll actually wipe out all the personal apps, all your personal information. So, for example, if you have a YouTube account, it'll wipe out uh, that you have possession of that account. It's almost like you're getting it out of the box. And, of course, people want to do this if they want to resell it or if they want to give it away. They just don't want anyone to have access to their previous history or accounts. So what we're going to do is go to the Home button right here. And then on the left here, you're going to scroll down all the way to you see the settings right there. And then you want to move to the right, click right, and go all the way down until you see System. Okay. And then we click OK. And then we go all the way down to Advanced System Settings. And then we go to our right. And sure enough, you have a thing for Factory Reset. And then we click OK. And then what you want to do is Factory Reset Everything. And it says, please enter code 6512 to reset everything. So this is not actual your code. This is a code that they want to verify, hey, I'm very serious about resetting it. Okay, so we'll go ahead and enter the code that they asked me to. 6512. And then I click everything. I guess that's so a, a kid doesn't code. A kid doesn't actually do it. That doesn't know what they're doing. And then it gives me a choice. If you factory reset your TV, you'll need to pair your remote and devices. For more help, go to Roku Reset. Start factory reset. See how well you can see that. Or cancel factory reset. No. We'll click OK. And there it goes. It could take anywhere from, I think, about five minutes. But it depends on the TV, I think. All right. Thanks for watching.